Hey guys, what is up? Uh, just making a commentary real quick, just asking you guys what's uh, been going on in your lives and stuff. And I've actually been doing a lot of stuff on RuneScape. I'm really satisfied. Uh, it's Friday, by the way. Thank, thank fucking Jesus, it's Friday. Because, uh, wow, I have a lot of homework. It is ridiculous. But I am going to be making those RuneScape gains as... Uh, right now, I'm just fucking, I decided I'd just play RuneScape today, and because YOLO, I guess. But I do, I actually did get a screenshot of me getting 70, 67 RuneCrafting. I was so, I never expect getting RuneCrafting levels, so it's always fucking cool when I get one. Uh, so yeah, I mean, as far as RuneScape, obviously I haven't leveled up my, oh my god, that is worst fucking misclick ever, holy shit. Um, but yeah, as far as RuneScape, not much uh, fucking stuff has gone on. As far as uh, skills, but oh my goodness, there have been a lot of really fucking cool things that uh, I ended up finishing. I ended up getting every single uh, purist I'm gonna need for uh, one or from whatever level I'm at right now, 76, no, 60, 67, yeah, uh, all the way to 91, which is awesome. It costed me, I believe, 18 point. What the fuck did I not? Oh my god, I am so adopted. I swear to God. Uh, but yeah, so I actually I'll just show you now since I'm fucking at my bank. Uh, I also bought energy potions, which is pretty cool. I'm still buying um 1k, so that's why I have my private on. Uh, I don't, I'm not gonna switch it off just to make a video. It'll be pretty cool actually if I get uh, someone PMing me about them when I'm making a video. So yeah, I did end up getting five 5.5k PRS. I got all at once. Uh, I figured I'd buy in stocks, and someone was uh, selling like four mil PRS, and I didn't have 34 mil. But I figured I'd buy them all at once just to get it over with. And I still have uh, 10 mil cash, which some of it is going towards, um, or 2.5 mil of it's going towards super energies, which is another uh, 1k pure, or fucking energies, which is really fucking cool, I guess. I'm um, pretty satisfied. So I'm going to have like a 7 mil cash, 7, 8 mil cash stack, and then I'm going to give uh, my friend Adam his money back. And then I'll have enough money for, um, I guess, just supplies or whatever. I don't know. Um, I might end up doing barrows or something along the way if I get really extremely bored. But um, I don't really know. I've just been AFKing the majority of the time of this anyways, watching uh, YouTube, whether it be whatever two shows I like watching. Either that or Netflix. So pretty fucking fun, honestly. I'm still enjoying it a lot. Uh, and yeah, so that's all I've been doing as far as RuneScape. But something really cool happened, and those of you who are subscribed to Chris Archie already uh, have seen this video, and it is cool. I'm so happy it happened. Uh, because back when I was lured on RuneScape, uh, I ended up losing, I think, 40 mil to someone's name, uh, or to someone whose name was Casket Chaser. And just a few days ago on Chris Archie, Ka uh, the same guy who fucking lured me for my shit, um, got killed for just, like, 30 or 40 mil, like, Fury got down for, like, everything but a DFS, so, uh, I was so fucking happy seeing that. I wasn't expecting that at all, I just glanced over, and I saw them right-clicking in, and I was like, wait a minute, holy fuck, and it was this guy who lured me, and I was just so happy that he died. I mean, as bad as that sounds, because normally on Chris Archie, you watch something and you feel pretty fucking bad about, um, the people in the, in the video, but... I had, like, an emotional connection with that fucking guy, so I'm so glad that he died. But, yeah, uh, the reason I decided to only go for 91 runecrafting is because of one main reason. Uh, I kind of figured it'd be really cool to get uh, 91 to 99 all at once, just buy all the PRS and do it whenever the fuck I really feel like it. Uh, and I will make so much money when I do that. And the another biggest reason is I will, when I'm done with these uh, 500k PRS order, 570, which I'm not going to do all of them. I'm going to do probably like uh, 540 or something like that, 530. Uh, and just until I get 91 or probably a little bit past just so I can see the majestic, beautiful um, pouch thing go in. Or uh, not pouch, what the hell am I talking about? Um, the like really cool um, <coughs> 2x fucking PRS, which would be awesome. But in general... I'll be making, throughout the entire thing, since I won't double anything, I'll be making 160 mil cash straight off the bat, and that is awesome. Honestly, I'm not going to lie, having 160 mil bank back all in one second is going to honestly make my fucking um, account just as happy as it was, and I have to spend about half the time getting it at the same, 
or at the same time. And I probably will finish it around two months or so still, since school has been kicking my ass. I haven't been able to uh, play too much, but still, it's gonna be really cool. And then probably during the summer, maybe I'll do a uh, 99 to 99 sometime if I um, ever have the time in the summer. I'm not sure what I'm gonna really be doing, but regardless, I think it's gonna be awesome still. And I want to make as good as content as I possibly can for you guys. So I might also, since some of you guys really want to watch Barrow's, uh, Barrow's videos or Banna's videos or whatever, I might eventually, when I get a bit more cash, maybe do a few Banna's commentaries, which would be really cool. And for sure when I'm done with this, I will do the one, uh, 1k Banna's kill, so don't worry about that. But as far as my actual plans with the money, as I said a long time ago when I was doing the uh, 1 million, where I was still planning on doing the 1 million thing, I'm not going to be able to do even half the stuff I wanted to do. I mean, I'm still probably going to end up getting, you know, 99 uh, cooking and fletching probably or whatever. Uh, but I won't have for sure, I won't have enough money to get all of my stuff back and um, stock bank whatever completely ready and have get 90 range. I mean, I might... But I'm just, I'm not so sure I'm going to actually be able to do that. So I might uh, train it a little bit maybe, but I have to get my void back and shit still. So that's going to be a huge pain in the ass. But I don't know. I'll find I'll find a way to uh, do pest control. And actually, if you guys want, I can make uh, pest control or back to void videos or whatever the fuck if you guys want me to. But I don't know how much I'm actually going to want to do that. I, I just, it's the fact that I'm taking so much time to do it. And then, um, like, documenting it at the same time is just going to take even more fucking time and effort. But um, I guess I don't mind commentating doing this because it is kind of relaxing at the same time. So, I don't know. I mean, just, I guess you guys can uh, tell me what you want to see in videos because I know some of you guys actually watch most of my videos even though the majority of my uh, commentary is just, or the majority of my video is just my commentary. Since I'm not, I haven't been doing a lot of stuff. When I get into PKing, though, for sure, I want you guys to watch the videos because they're gonna be really fucking awesome. Um, and I generally commentate pretty fucking ecstatically when I PK. Uh, I might swear called my uh, opponent adopted on multiple occasions, but it it just happens, I guess, when you PK. You just you know go on a little fit of rage and start uh calling or making fun of their parents and calling them adopted and. Saying that they get burned by steam irons and shit like that, etc. Uh, I get pretty fucking, I don't know. I, I just like, <laughs> I don't even know where the fuck I come with my insults. They're so fucking weird. But um, yeah, I enjoy commentating PKing. That's, that was honestly the biggest reason I started up YouTube again. Was for the hopes of one day being able to commentate uh, PKing. Because I used to love that on my old channel. Um, I, I don't know why. I just really enjoyed it. And all my friends gave me really good support at the same time in real life. And I thought it would be really, really cool if I got well-known on YouTube for that. But now I'm kind of more changed my scope on RuneScape. Now I'm just sort of more of a uh, skiller. Not necessarily. I don't enjoy it that much. But I still obviously would enjoy PKing. I just never have the fucking time or money to do so. But at the same time, oh my god, guys. Skilling isn't that bad. For those of you who don't like it, I mean, I, I mean my fucking whole way I play this game changed. I got Quest Cape. And I could get on my EOC account right now and show you guys. I am like, I've like barely just got Barrow's Gloves. Like I have 180 quest points or some shit like that. So bad. And the fact that I got Quest Cape all by myself, which I'm very fucking proud of on this game. It just, it just makes this fucking ridiculous how much I changed the way I played. And um, I got uh, high skills in general besides just uh, combat. I don't even have max combat, which I would have normally if I uh, played like I used to. But besides that, uh, one last little thing I wanted to talk about, since I know some of you guys are actually really interested in this. Uh, the reason I still play RuneScape, uh, I'm 17 right now, so just for a little age reference, that's how old I am. And yeah, I still play RuneScape. You know, I'm I'm in high school, etc. You know, it's probably still considered pretty fucking nerdy for most high schoolers to play RuneScape. Uh, in most states, I think. I don't know. In Florida, my friend says it's pretty fucking badass. But then again, he makes it sound badass. So, um, But, yeah, the reason I play RuneScape is... Uh, I just want to make it short. Because it is a very, very long story. Like, I could tell you from, like, the fucking beginning to what, what the fuck it's done for me. But, um, essentially, this game has meant so much to me in my past. It has helped me through so much in real life. And many of you guys can relate to the reason you still play RuneScape. But mostly my whole thing is it 
it's an escape, I guess, from reality. And in a weird sense, that's a very, very, very good thing. But it's also kind of a bad thing if you get too into it because it, it takes away from your personal life and it takes away from your um, uh, fucking friends or whatever the fuck. But I generally, I try to not play it too much because I do honestly just play it to enjoy my free time now. Uh, but the biggest reason why I still play it and I didn't like turn to another game is because it has just done so f much to me. And if I feel like if I quit it, I'm betraying my past a little in a sense, some weird sense. But um, honestly, I don't want to go like extremely deep into the feelings or whatever, but I was extremely depressed um, way back when, uh, probably around 5th fifth, fifth to 7th fifth to grade, 5th to 8th grade or some shit like that. Uh, I was pretty damn depressed uh, for multiple reasons. I have a shitty family life or whatever. I don't really necessarily like my family that much. Um, uh, I had a girl problems, uh, friends. I, I don't know. I was I was just kind of an asshole and I hated myself for it. Um, and there was just a lot of problems with me, and I don't know, I didn't have a good way of dealing with those problems at all, so instead of, um, you know, trying to take control of that, I, I blocked out and played RuneScape, and it I was always, an, I've always been a really nice person, I always, I've never meant wrong, I've never been, like, one of those fucking assholes in school just, like, fucking around with people, I've always been relatively nice and, uh, you know, not an asshole, um, if that makes any sense to you guys, but... RuneScape, or people always would just, I guess, essentially fuck me over, and when I come home, and I just play this game, and I get to, you know, be good at something, get to do something, um, with my free time, and, and feel like I'm achieving something, goals constantly, it takes your mind off of shit like that, and I've, I've had, um, a lot of bad fucking things go on in my life, like, I recently, within, it was, it's almost fucking shit, it was almost a year ago that, um, this happened, it doesn't feel that long ago, but, uh, I went through a breakup with a girl who I was in a long distance relationship with, and we were together for like ten months or whatever. And I really, 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 really loved her, um, because it wasn't like our relationship was based on physical attributions. I fell in love with her because of her, because of who she was, and um, it don't know. It hurt really, really, really bad, and RuneScape got me pretty much through that now. And I, I mean, I'm still not completely over it, obviously. Uh, because I wouldn't, I moaned, or I fucking, I was depressed over a girl for three years, and fucking, who, it was an elementary school crush, uh, so, I mean, I don't get over things that well, but RuneScape obviously helps me through the way, and honestly, I don't even know where I would be right now without RuneScape, I would probably not be, um, as happy as I am right now, and it's just, it's done so much for me as a person that I can't necessarily ever let it go, uh, I will obviously quit one day, but that'll be a long time from now, and that's why I'm honestly planning on going for Max, because it is just, it's such a fucking fun game for me, and it's not only just the fact that it's an awesome game, and most people, you know, play it just because uh, they have problems or whatever, or they um, just enjoy the game in general, but it does also have a emotional connection for me, so that's kind of why most people, I'll make a video like this similar, or similar to this in probably a few months or a year, or whatever the fuck, when um, I'm more well known on YouTube, just so more people can, uh, understand it but since you guys are um subscribed to me now i just figured you guys are probably interested in this as well so uh i'll do this again later obviously but yeah guys anyway that's all i really want to talk about this video There's some more things that i uh, are pretty interesting but the video's already dragged on way too long as it is so uh yeah guys thanks for watching this and uh i hope you guys um enjoyed for one and two comment down for why you guys play runescape i don't know why you guys do and I'm actually relatively interested because uh, some of you guys who have uh, added me and messaged me about, um, you know, RuneScape or just like, hey, I like your videos or whatever, you've um, always been really fucking cool. And I don't know, I just, I like getting in touch with my subscribers. So, yeah, guys, just tell me. I don't really care. I'm um, a pretty open person. I'm pretty cool about talking about um, feelings or whatever. So if you guys have any similar stories or just random out there stories while you play runescape just i don't know you like the fucking way the pixels look or some shit i don't know um just <laughs> comment down below guys and uh thanks for watching bye